What is up, ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to the next episode of the Elder series. Let's keep going, guys. We are trying to get the peacekeeping mission done for Interchange. We're also trying to go grab the part for Vitamins Part 1. And we are also, of course, trying to get five kills and place down some gold chains. So we got some tasks to complete. Are you ready? Right, I'm going to try to see if I can catch anyone running this way. I'm sure I'm a full auto. I am. I'm at the perfect time to do this. And there's a spawn close to us. It's if they spawn next to us. Kind of expecting them by now. Just taking a look. Okay, nothing. All right, let's keep moving. We can go place down the uh, gold chains and then work away. Well, all right then. Scav. You just yell at me the whole time and then run away. All right, eight more scab kills to go. We're gonna head this way. We gotta go place down these gold chains at the weapon shop over here. I forget the name of it, but yeah, it's one over here. It's about four in the morning, so if we do find players, they do count towards the uh, quest we're trying to complete. Saw somebody. All right, let's get these placed down. Place these down, listen up for players. And even technically scabs, because if I get caught here, place this one. Scab could definitely one tap me. I've seen it happen before. It's not fun, but it happens. Okay, it's one. Oh. Didn't, didn't mean to do that. It's gonna keep getting what we can get done here. It would, it'll be nice because we already we're ready to finish up the next part of this. Vitamins Part Two is already set to be done. It's just the four gas masks or respirators and three blood sets. We have all that, so we will definitely look to get that finished up and then it's on to more quests over on streets I believe the beyond the meat part one unlocks the nine millimeter vector I don't expect to really be using that but I am saving up the ammo to get myself um am I hearing someone I, guess I think I was hearing the holly stuff. Uh, I am saving up all the ammo to run a 45 vector, though. I still don't have a lot of ammo for it just yet, so I definitely need to save up for it. That way it's worth it. Because right now I can only do, like, one raid and it'll be done. But I want to be able to run multiple raids for it, you know? Alright, is there any scabs back here at all? Oh, there's some dead scabs. Oh, all right. <coughs> Ow. Is that a player that shot me?
don't think that was a, a scab. I think it was a player that shot me. I definitely hear him. I feel stupid if this is a scab, by the way. Could kind of sound like a scab at this point. It was a scav. Get the arm repaired. Strange though. You must have looked away and immediately shot, but typically scabs like yell at you when they after they get into doing that. Alright, let's go get this uh vial over here. So gotta get all these scab kills, but we can I just creep around the mall a little bit more. I'm kind of curious what the percentage chances of running into Killa. Because I don't think we've seen him yet, this white. As far as I'm aware, we haven't seen him. It's just a DVD drive in there. We got some scabs in the middle. Let's we'll check out idea. There's a bunch of scab sounds over there. I want to see if there's any thing over here to, to take, which doesn't look like it. <laughs> okay, never mind. Let me make sure that we're looting. Flechette! Hello, Flechette. I am still collecting ammo for shotguns because we do have Silent Caliber coming up at some point. I forget what quest we have to do next, though, to actually get that unlocked. Scab up front. I 
think really is really self for that much, but I gotta get something out of this run. Hollows. Oh, that is a scav. Okay. I don't want to talk about it. This has all been looted, but we'll double check it anyway. This here movement. G phone. I need the G phone still. It looks like she hasn't been looted. I need the G phones for that uh, networking quest farther down the line. I mean, it's actually not too far down the line now I think about it, but it's going to be coming up at some point. Biggest thing is that 6B43 armor. It's starting to really become a nuisance in finding it. Because I can't, like, outright buy it right now. I basically have to find a guard that's wearing it. Like this. Drive. How many more kills do we need here? Sales night, peacekeeping mission, which uh, we're at seven right now. Okay. We need five more, five more kills. We can go check underneath, I guess. I check this now, good night. There's actually one coming our way. Scav, where are you though? We'll go check in the underground. Four more. any more down here. What about in the little, little entrance over here? Look time times sometimes we find them over here too. Oh my favorite bag isn't here right now. That's sad. There's like that that specific bag in the corner. I feel like I like every wipe I get one good item out of it. And it wasn't the Previous wipe, I think the last wipe, I think the craziest thing we got out of it was like a roller, which is not that crazy. But the wipe before that, we ended up getting a Lettix out of that bag. So, to me, it's a very good bag. Let's load it up here. I mean, the front of the mall should have what we're looking for. The four kills. I'm not talking like that the main road is where I'm talking about from the mall. I will go to the front entrance quickly and see if there's any over there.
Pretty sure I hear some. It could also be a player, though. I think that is actually a player. There's a player. Hmm. Well, they, well, they were lagging, by the way. See if they're gonna peek their head this way. So we got two over there. There's a lot of shooting over at idea right now. I don't think they're gonna peek anymore. Oh, but what's the scav? Oh boy. I mean, this is good. Okay, I'm coming. I didn't look up. Jeez. I had no idea he was even there. Alright, we got the subtask done. Let's get out of here. Close up, close up some ammo here. Through a decent amount doing all that. All right, now we can start heading towards the exit. <laughs> Feel like I should probably get all mags loaded up. For this, you know, for the random chance we do run to a player. I'm not saying we're going to, but may. Right, let's start heading over towards the exit. I haven't seen any of those PMCs yet that were fighting. And my guess is they're either still in the mall or they took some other exit out. Obviously, he's still watching out just in case they do show up at the last second. Maybe to my way for sure. But we're getting out of here. And we need to get these quests turned in. Or, quests to turn on the quests in. 
We get a little bit extra XP and moving towards our goal. That decent run though. Okay, let's go do this. Come over to skier. Turn in. Turn in. There we go. And completed. It's gonna give me vitamins part two. Uh what do we get for this one? 13,000 plus a little bit of extra stuff. Jaeger should be fine. Yeah, he's completely fine. Uh go back to skier. Vitamins part two. Turn in three of those. I, I think I had four just in case. In all of the respirators, we can finally turn in. Completed. So we got Beyond the Red Meat, which we have to go collect a thing in the, or it's like a book we have to collect inside of the um, Beluga Room. Ooh, I actually really need to do this for this too. Because if I'm going to use any AKs, I guess I'm using that. Although I don't know if I'm really going to use AKs this white. It's kind of uh, meh. It's kind of meh. You know? <laughs> anyway, and then we have Pyramid Scheme. Pyramid Scheme, we just gotta find every single one of these ATMs on streets. It's not that crazy. It looks like a lot. It is a lot, but it's not like it's nuts. So basically, I just gotta walk around the whole map. I don't know if it has to be all done in one try, or if you can basically just keep going back and forth. I'll have to look at that. I know the reward for this is like 600,000 rubles or something like that. It's pretty nuts, the reward of the cash on that one. Well, yeah, we're gonna have to go back. We need to get these five kills to really continue getting quests going with uh, Skier here. So we'll definitely need to do that in the corridor, of course, and then all the other fun things we gotta do. But I think for now, let's get all this stuff dropped off. I did clean up the stash, by the way. I did say I was gonna do that. So it is all cleaned up. Let me put that inside the junk box. But we uh, cleaned up everything, made a little more extra room. It's looking a lot more tidier. There's some stuff inside of here, like mags and all the other fun stuff. So, yeah, there you go. A little bit of insight of what we got going on. Uh, beyond that, oh, and at the bottom, we do have just random bags. It's got the valves in it, plus the other pistol case we got. Yeah, nothing really crazy going on there. I kind of want to head over to reserve to start working on those quests. Uh, what do you call it? Um, get the name pest control and safe corridor. I kind of want to head over there, so I think I might do that. Plus, I need to get kills anyway for the Untar stuff for a uh, peacekeeping mission. So, why don't I do this? I'm gonna grab my keys for the lockers down below, and uh, we'll do a little bit of looting while we're there and uh, see what we can make happen. So, let's head over to reserve and let's do this. All right, let's do it. Ooh, we're kind of close to the spawn actually. We wanted to get so let's go down there. This could take a while. I will just point that out now. We have a lot of lot of wait time, I'm sure. Unless we get really lucky, we can, this one could take a while. It's like pass control, but we'll do our best. Get as many, kill, many kills as we possibly can, and go from there. I still can't figure out the one key. So it's the it's the cage that's down here. That's the far from where we're at right now. It's the far back right. For some reason, I just cannot, for some reason, like find on the flea market. I know the name of it. <clears throat> I know the name of it. It's PSV1. But it never shows up. I don't know if it's like a key that no one has or or what. But this is like three three wipes in a row now. I've tried to find that key and it just never shows up. It's kind of annoying, I ain't gonna lie. Right, let's do a little bit of looting. And then we'll listen out for the scabarinos. I'm mostly here for sugar and vodka. And anything else I can really get. If I can get enough herring and all the other just drinks and stuff, then I'll I'll put that towards some other stuff later. Of the trunk of that vehicle over there was a person. I won't say no to lunch boxes though. Alright, that's one. Some 
good stuff, please. How about over here? What do we got? No parts for days, apparently. Chocolate would be a good one to collect as well. Cause like right now sugar's not selling for a lot, but at some point people are gonna need a ton of it. Can't shoot through these very well, so I can go out and get them. Are you on the corner there? He's over here. Oh. Is that him? Okay, that's two. Go back to doing our looting. And all that, good. Keys look early on. <laughs> you could have the peacekeeper, or not peacekeeper, uh, uh, the Jaeger quest done like in seconds. You know, for the amount that you can find. Alright, what else we got? We got a crate here. We got a tech crate. Nice paracord. Actually, I needed that paracord because I forgot one. <laughs> that was perfect. So now we can actually take the paracord exit. Love it. And we need food. Obviously, we could just take it from here. Take the milk from this one. Oh, wait, which one was it? Just drink that out. Did I search this one? I did not. And nothing in it. Okay, we can go across the way because we got the key for the old one over here. mostly medical but I believe there's a rations one as well oh it's a text right here it's gonna, get, uh, it's gonna, it's gonna be gas fuel thermites Toothpaste is still selling for a decent amount, so we'll take it. Drop that fuel. It's too heavy. That's right, blood sets aren't selling for much anymore. Kind of sucks. It's a nice one they're selling for a good amount. All right, that's all the looting from those rooms. I was hoping for more, more of them to spawn. Unfortunately, what I'm gonna have to do is go to the far back corner over here, 
basically wait for them to spawn in. But they will spawn in. I just gotta give them a t give them time to do it. Get this guy quickly. So we'll we'll run back here. Actually, isn't there? No, no, that's the crate I saw from the other room. But yeah, I gotta chill back here for a little bit, and then in a tiny bit we'll go up and see if any of them spawned in. It's the unfortunate about, about, about this quest if I only get it done within a reasonable amount of time, I should say. Let's see where we're at right now, safe board order. We're at two, that's right. We need eight more. Alright, we gave it a few minutes. Let's go take a look again. Again, I don't expect to finish this quest in... You know, one raid. But I want to try to get as many as I can. <coughs> Ow. There's a player? Got him. Hey, hey. Yeah. Timing on that, man. That mag loaded up. Dude came out of nowhere. At least I didn't hear him, I should say. All right, why don't we, where do we head out now? Probably safe for all of us in this matter. Come in here. I can't kill you while you're over there. I'm gonna wait to see if he comes back this way. Yeah, please come back. I don't think it's gonna happen. It's fine. We can we can get out, secure this stuff quickly, and then we'll come back in. It'd be nice if someone were to hit her hermetic, but I don't think that's gonna happen. We'll head out. So, two scabs and a player. The player is definitely not a requirement. I'm just kind of by happen chance, or happenstance, I should say. Um, I'm just gonna take this and this. He only had one mag in this, didn't he? He did. I'd rather have the stamina, so I can keep moving. Although I'm gonna have to figure something out for that then. Yeah, I just thought about that actually. Go like that. All right, let's get moving. I don't know if I point this out or not for this quest, but basically, what's going are these two quests? I should say. Basically, if I don't find them, you know, in this 
or if I like, oh, oops, I, I, I completely messed up. Sorry. If I spawn on that side of the map, we'll go do safe corridor. I spawn on this side of the map, we'll do pest control. I don't remember if I mentioned that or not. And if I don't find either of them. I don't know what we're going to do then. Definitely heard running. I don't know. Could have been scab, could have been I'm sure it's a player actually. I don't remember if scabs ever being up here like ever. So all good. We're gonna drop all this stuff off and come right back in. Alright, well just going right next to the spot. And let's do it. Let's go see if we can get some loot before the scabs actually start spawning in. If we get lucky enough, we'll get Bluehar in the, in the boys in this area. But I highly doubt it's going to happen. I highly doubt it. I got lucky once with that, that's about it. I feel like Tarkov's not going to be that nice to me again. It'd be nice if this quest was... Kill... Kill anything in these two barracks I believe that this quest would be a lot better. I truly believe that. But the fact that you have to, you know, do this over and over in this one location waiting for a scab to finally come in, it's kind of annoying. But we'll just do some loot and like I said, I'm gonna get ready. J6, take that, and nothing else. I feel like I need to bring a pistol with me. I feel like a pistol would be a good idea. Shoot in the air or something. Scabs will come our way. You know what? Should bring that drink with us. I'm probably going to need it in a little while. You know, we got our, we got our lunch too. Nice. Now, I said last episode that we had inventory check all ready to go. Uh, apparently I actually am missing two keys. I thought I had the right ones, but apparently I am too off. I need the OR or the RB ORB2. In the OR, in the, in the, I think it's the RBOB. Is the other one we're missing. Which is unfortunate, but we'll find them. If not, we'll have to buy them. They're, they're kind of expensive. It's like, it's like a 600,000 ruble investment if I want to do it. I'm not sure I want to actually spend those rubles just yet. see anything on this floor maybe on the other end they I, I will say this definitely needs a revamp this quest really needs a revamp for sure make it include the courtyard area and this would be a golden quest would be good to go but the fact that it doesn't it kind of screws you over a little bit This one's always open, so it's kind of a given one.
Uh, I'm not going to stay in here because I can't see in there. I may do this at night time. That way people aren't like immediately killed in scabs. I will say that I refuse to sit around all day long waiting for this, this quest specifically. So if we don't see anything relatively soon, we will leave. Because it, it could take almost all raid to make it happen. And it sucks because like you need this quest to, to move on to killing Blueheart and stuff. And I would like to kill Blueheart because Blueheart gives you a weapon case. So I mean it's worth it. But the time to wait is definitely not worth it. Back down to the first floor in a second and get ready. Are these all bathrooms? They are. Okay. Just checking for any loot that I can take. Might as well get it now. You know, for when we're ready to go, we can just head up. Matches. Matches are definitely not on my list of things to get. <laughs> they do not cost like anything. That we haven't even heard a scab yet is kind of frustrating, <laughs> to say the least. Nothing. And the funny part is I could like sit right here the whole time and just kind of hang out here and I'll probably see maybe one or two. I, I, and then, and two would be a stretch. I mean, you guys remember when we did this quest last time, it took us a literal century to finish it. Is that regular PP ammo or is that, oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah, I guess we'll take it. I mean, put it right there. Yeah. I think I'm going to switch my tactic up on this one. Instead of waiting here now, I'm going to go though. And, um, we'll do this one at night. I don't want to torture you guys for the next, you know, 10 minutes. I mean,
What am I hearing? I, could, I tried to run right there. I couldn't even run. How did I not kill that first guy? And then the second one, I don't think I really hit him that much. But the first one should have definitely been dead. That sucks. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. I think they're literally doing the exact same thing, waiting for scabs to spawn in. Uh, I don't know. I was ready for him, too. I knew he was going to peek that side. Four hit count. There's no way it's only four hit count. What? All right, well, we spawned at the uh, barracks again, so I might as well just keep trying to do this one again. Hopefully, we actually spawn in. Try to do a little bit more over here. And this time, not get killed. Right, let's go up here. The red dot on. Uh, what side am I on? Oh. I'm on this side. Okay. So I'm close to, I believe, to the school, right? Yes. No. I'm in the other one. I kind of like the other one better, actually. Also, I'm pretty sure there is a close spot here. So I gotta be real careful about that. Alright, jump over here. Hopefully we get some at least one or two scabs to come over here. And then uh, we'll go from there. This one's way like I said, this one's way more important than doing the whole safe corridor one. Because safe corridor leads to nowhere. It is just quest done, that's it. Splints. CMS. Now, what I was saying, like, this is gonna take a while. Like, I could probably watch a whole movie and I maybe only see like three scabs. That's the the funny part about it. I didn't hear anyone come this way, but I will loot up and then we'll just like wait and listen out. It may take like a while to do this, like I said, but. We've got about like 10 minutes before this episode really needs to end. So, we'll give it some time. I'm just gonna loot up, listen out, and I'll bring you guys back if there's anything that happens. Well, we haven't got anyone yet, but we got all our loot. This is everything that we be, uh, were able to pick up throughout this whole building. So, at least we got the loot. Now it's just pretty much just, again, waiting for the scabs. Uh, I do want to clarify though what I said last raid that I was going to be doing this at night uh obviously I can't do this with night vision on so because I have to have the untar armor on and whatnot but I feel like nighttime maybe the less people will shoot the scabs will give you more chance for them to spawn in and come this direction but I wanted to give daytime a try warm time and see what happens I can tell you what this is the next day that I'm filming this this raid and I am waking up, so I'm gonna just kind of sit here, sip my coffee, and hopefully something happens. If it doesn't happen within the next, like, well, for me, it'd be 
five minutes. Probably 30 seconds for you guys. But uh, if nothing really happens, we'll get out of here and I'll try to come up with a plan of doing this at night time and try to brighten it up so you all be able to see. But this is, this is brutal. I've heard, I haven't even heard a person shoot yet, let alone a scat. So, I'll let you know of any update. There's some footsteps. I think there's someone over here. But there's a scab or a player, I'm not sure. But I definitely heard something go from this direction. I'm hearing them. Hopefully they're gonna come this way. I don't know if they will. I think this is gonna be my only attempt to get something. It's not like over by the school area. Nothing. Oh. I need that scab to come over here. Come here. If you're new to this quest and you have no idea what I'm doing, by the way, if you haven't asked that question already in the comments, basically, I can't kill a scab anywhere outside this building or the other barracks over there they have to pretty much be hugging the building for me to get credit on it oh is he coming my way One. That should be two. Let's take a look. Uh, pest control, pest control. Did I pass it? I did. There it is. Two. Two so far. Out of ten. There's another scab over there. I'm going to try to shoot him again to come over here. Just gotta find them again. I'm hoping the shots are gonna attract in this direction. Cause this would be nice to finish this up. Or at least get three or four of them. I just saw you, but I don't know what direction you went. I think that one went in the other building. There is someone inside the school. I don't, I can't see you. What? Where? More to the right? Need 
что тут есть, что нет? Гиги! Where you at? I don't know what you're saying, bro. See over in the other, like upstairs, maybe. Come on. I think got. I think there's two of them over there. They're just waiting for me to push. That's not bad. That's not bad. I'll take that. Yeah, he was waiting for me to go down there. Those two players scab too. My hope is like, I guess. Or I guess my plan would have to be player scavs. If I can get them to come this direction and fight them, that'll probably play out best for us. Drop that, take this one.
that counted. That's six. One, two, three. Four, five, yeah, that should be six, yep. I need this one to get closer. I can't shoot him where he's at. Shoot him, see if he'll come this way. Come here, Scavo. Come. I only need four more of you creeps. Oh, he got me with a headshot. You lucky son of a gun. <laughs> Whatever. We got six kills out of that. I really don't care about the gear. I mean, I would like to get out with the gear, but. Can't believe he headshot me like that. <laughs> well, we're going to go back next episode and. We'll, uh, we'll, I didn't even mean to do that. I meant to look at the profile. Whatever. We'll figure it out for next episode. Well, I didn't mean to actually report his name, but uh, yeah, looking at his profile, uh, that mister only had 30 raids, and uh, he's level 40. Okay, well, let's uh, let's go take a look here. We need to get some water in us, too, because I just completely lost all my hydration running through that map without drinking anything, so buy one of these. All right. We need to get out of here. We've been in this, this uh, episode for a very long time, so it is time to end it. But at least we got out with, what, one raid? I'll take it. At least it's a decent amount of stuff we'll to make some money from. Drop off all the other stuff. Um, we're almost done and ready for textile part one and two. We just got to find more keck tape. I got to make some more fleece. And then I believe I just made the last two of these guys for the airmen. So we've got a good amount of stuff ready to go. But ladies and gentlemen, I need to get out of here and we'll have to come back next episode and finish up some more stuff. Four more kills left to go on pest control. We are slow but surely finishing up. So if you guys enjoyed today's episode of the Ride Ridge series, make sure you get a thumbs up. Leave a comment down below what you enjoy about the episode, what you excited about for the future. If you haven't yet, subscribe, ding the notification bell, and I'll see you in the next one.